Alright, Jeff. Uh. <clears throat> worst paint screw ups ever, huh? Well, uh. Yeah, I turned on the camera. Angel wanted to know why. I told her I had to tell a story, and she wanted to know if it was to tell everybody how good dinner was. <laughs> ah! And I said, no, I'm making a video of you doing the dishes. So, yep, yeah, dinner was delicious. Mmm. Yeah. Anyway, um, luckily my, uh, you know, I guess I'm lucky because uh, before I ever tried painting, I watched my cousin paint a lot. So I already knew pretty much how you were supposed to look and how you're supposed to hold the gun and what you're supposed to do. So uh, when I first started, I really didn't have any trouble. Uh, the first thing I painted at the dealership was an Impala SS, like the you know the '90s body styles ones <clears throat> or whatever, and it was just a spot job blend and it looked sweet. And uh, I was a body man before that. The painter quit or got fired, I don't remember, and uh, I just said, hey, I want to be a painter, and so I just started painting. So I did that one to see how it went, and it went sweet, so then my next thing was to paint uh, a bunch of work trucks, uh, full-size Chevy, long bed, white, uh, sand them all down and just shoot them single stage. I ran all three of them all over the place. So it took me a while to get white down, because <laughs> I couldn't see, as you know how that goes. But anyway, uh, before I started painting, there was there was two other painters, and one of them was a younger guy, and uh, he was painting a black S10. And he uh, was painting the inside of the bed. I don't remember why we had to paint the inside of the bed, but we did. And uh, he set up benches alongside each side of the bed sides so he could stand on them and lean over it and paint the bed floor. Well, he was leaning into the bedside with his knees and uh, he dented it all the way down both sides. There's knee, knee marks, probably 10 dents down each side of the bed sides. So that was sweet. And the same guy on another job uh, was in there painting a car and first, put his first coat of clear on. Uh, stepped outside the booth, took his respirator off, hung it up on something on the outside of the booth, uh, waited 10 minutes, went to grab his respirator to head back into the booth, pulled his respirator, and set the fire extinguisher system off, because that's what he was hanging it on. And all that white powder and fire suppressant stuff went all over his paint job. And that was sweet. Filled the booth up with that stuff. That's what all I got. Uh, so yeah good stories. Other than that, everything I ever do turns out perfect. Mm-hmm.